Hello everybody, Marcel Harding here. Welcome to my channel, Marcel Harding. Today I thought I'd do 2019 review <coughs> of my still lights that I've painted. <coughs> Since it's right at the end of the year, it's actually Christmas Day in New Zealand. But that's all good in the hood. Uh, we're a day ahead of the rest of the world, New Zealand and Australia. Merry, <coughs> Merry Christmas anyway. In a few hours, the rest of the world will catch up. But uh, this is going to be a review of 2019 review of my still life paintings I've done this year. And as you can see, these are all my still life paintings. I've done a lot. Uh, tomorrow I'll be doing landscapes. And that's even bigger. <laughs> so there's a lot of still lives here. I've done a lot of paintings this year. Probably about 150 paintings so far this year. <clears throat> I should say so far because I'm actually going to paint a couple more paintings. And uh, that'll be it for the year. But uh, I started the year off. Uh, with uh, painting pumpkins uh, Whole and halves and quarters and that so we'll get started. So this is the pumpkin here New Zealand pumpkin It's all good Yep Here's another one here pumpkin here of uh, pumpkin on the uh, a wing thing really 1930s wing thing tower pretty cool uh, this is of Fijoas painting Fijoas with a little brown box pretty cool now this is painting pears they're all mixed up. They're not in order, so it'll be back and forth. <coughs> this is painting a couple of pairs here. I got a lot of flak for this painting. I don't know why, because it's a good painting. I don't know why I got flak for it. Here's another one of uh, two uh, an apple cut in half, Fijoas, and in, in the brown box again. Again, here's, here's the uh, pumpkins cut into quarters with the uh, red weighing box. It's actually a good painting, this one, believe it or not. This is actually a very good painting. Oh, I love painting green apples. Um, I love painting green apples. Uh, these are Granny Smith apples. I love them. Um, painting green apples is really cool. I'm really proud of that painting. It came out really good. Here's some more green. I've painted a few green apples here. There's a, a half, an apple cut in half. More Granny Smiths. That came out pretty good. Painting some more Fijos and a red apple here. The Fijos came out pretty good on this one, actually. Sort of the red apple. Quite good painting. This is just a red apple on a tree. Um, yeah, that came out all right. Red apple on a tree. Here's another one of a red apple of the... Um, Brown box again, some leaves. Here's my favorite Granny Smith apples, green apples. <laughs> I love painting green apples. Uh, this is a vase, red curtains behind it. I made the background up. I painted this vase a few times actually. Because that phase again and more green apples. Looked alright. That's actually quite a good painting. It turned out pretty good, this one. Did a good job with the vase, too. 
There's the vase again. More green apples because I love green apples. <laughs> Turned out alright. And even more green apples. How cool is that? And another vase here. Yeah. Looks like it's it's stuck. It looked it turned out alright. Now these green apples here are, are all cut in half. Granny Smith green apples in the vase again. They're all cut in half. That's pretty cool. I did a few of these paintings like this. Worked out pretty good. Uh, this is when I painted some lemons, some half lemons here. I did a quite a lot of paintings on lemons and, and limes. Lemons in a biscuit tin. That's all good. Half lemons, I should say. So these are these are whole lemons on a branch. Still whole lemons on a branch. Look, they worked out pretty good actually on these ones here. This is quite a good painting here. I used molding paste on that. It's full of texture. Came out pretty good. There's some more whole lemons. Got a branch. Some more lemons. And I used molding paste on the, on the lemons, as you can see, to give it texture. Well, you may not be able to see, but I put molding paste on it. Give it some more texture. Some more lemons here. I did quite a few paintings on the lemons. There's about 10 of them. So, lots of practice on them. Again, I used mold and paste. Actually, it turned out pretty good, that one. Quite proud of that one. There's some more lemons here on the mold. Put mold and paste on it. It's not the best, but it's okay. Here's some half lemons and some whole lemons here. That turned out alright. It's not too bad. Not perfect. It's some more lemons here. They look like oranges, I know. But the lemons. Here's another uh, pumpkin, whole pumpkin. Like I said, they're all bundled up. I haven't got them in order. I can't be bothered, I'm lazy. Here's a series I did on uh, on some more lemons here. I painted a lot of lemons, so in a, in a different vase here. Phase is quite hard to paint actually, the shape of it. But it turned out alright. There's another one of it, another version of it. Here's another version of it again. Probably not the best one to paint actually, this one didn't really look that good. But I got it anyway. Now this is quite a good one here. I like this. It turned out pretty good. Now this, I did a series here, about half a dozen. Well, these are really good. These are my favorite paintings, these ones. I really like these ones. These ones worked out really well of uh, still life paintings. 
uh, a theme. It's got mushrooms in it. I mean, I really like this series here. It worked out really well. It just looked really good, you know. Did a good job on these ones here, actually. They're pretty good. Worked out really well. Um, I like the way I painted the mushrooms. It did a good job of it, actually. These are my favorite series, these ones here. They worked, everything just went to plan. Yeah, this turned out pretty good, this one here, actually. I like the way I painted the grapes. It was really well painted. I like, quite like the way I did that. That's pretty cool. Oh, this is pretty good. This worked out all right. A whole lot of uh, pears and apples. This one's quite a colourful one with the grapes and everything. You know that? I think the grapes are pretty rough. It's green and red apples on it. Looking alright. I like the vase. Some more lemons because I did. I painted a whole lot of them. Some of them uh, peeled, some of them whole. It worked out okay. I think these here are limes. I painted some limes. Now, you've got green limes and you've got yellow limes. In New Zealand, we have yellow limes. Other countries, they've got green limes. Green limes, are, limes are usually green, I know. But these limes were yellow. Yellowish with a tint of green on them. So, uh, there's some limes I painted. Painted some more limes here too, as you can see. They're not lemons, they're actually limes, these ones here. And uh, the yellow limes. That looks all right. There you go, some more lemons here. It's all mixed up. And finally, the last one here is of limes. I like 